Welcome back to the With or Without Fur channel. Today's special guest is this Fur Real Friends Torch, my blazing dragon. I found him at Goodwill the other day for $5 and he had a tag on him that said as is. So I wasn't sure if he was going to work and if I would take him apart or not. But I have decided that I did test him a little bit and it looks like he does work. He doesn't have the bottle or the toasted marshmallow that he's supposed to come with, but I have sponsored a family from one of the fires here. And they have a little four-year-old boy and I would love to fix this guy up, make sure he's working, get him super clean, and then donate him to that family. So I hope you guys understand that I am not going to take him apart today, but we're going to fix him up and get him a new home because I think he's like really special. And I think he'd be great for a four-year-old little boy. So why don't we see if we can figure out how he works and see if we can get that flame going. Take a look. Wow. 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 You can pose him. In a number of ways. Oh. Look. <laughs> so, I mean, it looks like he's working pretty well, don't you think? So, apparently, you were supposed to have this little squeeze bottle. And you're supposed to squeeze water in this tiny little hole. And so, what I'm going to do... <laughs> I don't have a squeeze bottle, but I have like this little thing. And so hopefully I don't get him like too wet. We can put some water in there and see if we can get this working. Oh, I think that's uh, full. All right, let's see if we can get him to blow out some flames. Oh, I can see it already. Can you see it? Oh, that's so cool. Wow, he's cool. <laughs> that is super cool. <laughs> so you can see that he's in fairly good condition. He's got some, I think, a little bit of paint, you know, some dirt here. His fur could uh, use some cleaning. He's got some marks. So I will work on trying to restore him to look like he's as new as we can do. So I'm just going to use some, like, wipes to get surface dirt off. Um, uh, Mr. Clean, like melamine sponge to get some of, if there's anything that's really hard to get off, out, off of the plastic parts. And then we'll probably just take one of those wipes and clean the fur as much as I can. And then I take a cat brush <laughs> and do the fur for some reason. <laughs> It gets it really looking nice and soft again. So we will get started with that. Wow. <laughs> wow. Well, here he is, pretty well all cleaned up. So it looks pretty good. It paint a little bit on the tooth, but I kind of, it has just a little mark, a couple marks, but I don't really think I need to. So hopefully this will make a little boy very happy. I think this was cool. I've been looking for one of these for, oh, almost two years since I started this channel. Yeah, you got the hiccups. <laughs> There's a link in the description for their GoFundMe. So if you want to help the same family, um, you can, and that would be great. These families really, really 
really need something. And a lot of them are starting to give up hope. It's been 30 days since they've had a home. Anyway, I know I've been rambling about this, but if you find that you can help someone from paradise this holiday season, that would be great. And that's where this guy is going. He's going home with a little boy who lost his home in the fire so that he will have some new toys for this Christmas. So thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.